Well, today, ladies and gentlemen, it's an absolute honor and a privilege to be able to share with you all this awesome guitar and to be able to represent my home state of Pennsylvania. Today, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to be checking out an Astra from Balaguer Guitars. Let's get into it. So what is going on everybody? Thank you so much for joining me for today's video. My name is Ray, I'm a guitar player here on YouTube, and yeah man, I get to talk about Balaguer Guitars once again. I'm excited man, I, I love to be able to talk about Joe and the Balaguer Guitars team man. They're just great man, they really are. So right off the bat, unfortunately this guitar is not mine, and you would think it would be because it's the sickest finish of all time, you know, Silver Burst, right? Uh, but now this is actually on loan from a local gentleman by the name of Scott. Scott, thank you so much for letting me uh, check out your guitar man. And actually, Scott's in a local band called Frost Giant. I'll put the links down below to his band, a couple YouTube videos and stuff like that. Down below if you guys want to check it out. So I just want to say thank you uh, so much in advance, dude, for allowing me to have your guitar here on vacation. It means a lot. So ladies and gentlemen, this is in fact a custom guitar from Balaguer Guitars. If you're unaware of it, Balaguer Guitars does do in fact take custom orders and you can build your own, you know, guitar. And it's, I know, that's awesome, man. That's, that's such a cool feature that Balaguer Guitars offers to the customer, and this is one of those, uh, you know, finished products, if you will. Specs with this guitar, mahogany body, wenge neck, 22 jumbo stainless steel frets, Floyd Rose, we have evergreen pickups, Balaguer evergreen pickups. We have a push-pull volume for pickup selecting, which is something I've never seen before in my entire life. That's crazy, right? We got locking tuners to match the locking nut for the Floyd, that's cool. Pearl block inlays, side dot lumen lays, triple binding, and yeah, just an awesome guitar. <laughs> The last thing I'll say, this is not silver burst. This is actually metallic white, and it gives it such as an awesome, an awesome aesthetic, man. Like, this is arguably the coolest finish I've ever seen in my entire life. So, it is not like metallic silver, it's metallic white. Just a little fun fact there. But those are the specs, man, but let's see how this thing sounds, all right? So this guitar is tuned to drop C sharp, all right? And for the demo song, I'm going to be using a combination of amplifiers, actually. An EVH Stealth, as well as a Diesel VH2 for different tracks, just blending them all together, giving, you know, a nice giant wall of sound, you know what I mean? It sounds, ah, it sounds pretty cool. After the demo song, I'll give you some isolated guitars of said demo song, and then we'll come back and we'll riff out, we'll chug, we'll hang out, we'll have some fun with this guitar, man. And then after all that, we'll wrap everything up, and I will give you guys my honest opinion about this guitar, okay? So with that all being said, let's get into everything that I just described right now.
So, ladies and gentlemen, what do we think of this guitar? Well, honestly, guys, <laughs> pretty badass. <laughs> I mean, come on, it's pretty sick. Now, right off the bat, there is nothing wrong with this guitar. There are no negatives with this guitar, man. There's only one personal preference that I would choose if this was my guitar, but again, it's not my guitar, so my opinion is kind of irrelevant, but uh, I'm just not a Floyd guy. You know, I'm not a dive bomber. I'm not a shredder. I would much prefer a hardtail. Another thing, the Evergreen Pickups, Balagir Guitar makes awesome pickups. If you guys have ever had the ability to try out a Balagir Guitar and try out their pickups, I think the pickups sound really, really good. In my opinion, now I could be way naive, but a lot of the Balaguer guitars that I played certainly cater towards hard rock and metal players. Again, I don't know if that's factual, um, but I've played give or take like three or four Balaguer guitars in my life now, um, and they all have a decent amount of output and a decent amount of clarity and punch and, and chunkiness. You know, the, they do the metal, you know what I mean? So. Um, yeah, the Evergreen pickups, they sounded great for me. But the main positive and the glaring positive that you guys already know what I'm going to say, ladies and gentlemen, again, I've said it kind of like three times already, this is the sickest finish I've ever seen in my life, man. Like, look at this thing, dude. <laughs> like, it is so cool. Oh, another thing, too. It's satin on the back. I forgot to mention that. Look at that. That's badass, too, right? So you got a matching burst on both sides. Gloss on the top, satin on the back. Business up front, party in the back, you know what I mean? Um, I don't know why I said that. <laughs> but anyway, this thing is just so sick, man. The finish and the, the, the aesthetic is perfect, man. It's everything that I've ever wanted in a single cut guitar. And yeah, man, it's just, it looks beautiful. Balaguer Guitars is not asking for this video. They didn't even know I was making this video. Um, but honestly, man, like in all seriousness, the fact that I get to continue to showcase their products um, is just such a cool thing for me. You know, like I said a million times, they're right down the road for me. They're so close. And anytime I get to wave the flag of a local business and wave the flag of my home state, Pennsylvania, I'm just so proud and I'm so like um, enthused just a little bit more. It's just like a cool, it's a cool thing. You know what I mean? Like there's not too many, I don't know. It, Pennsylvania is not really known for like a big time metal place, really. You know, you think of New York, California, Texas, but Pennsylvania is kind of like a little niche. So anyway, all I'm saying is, man, I love to, to support Battle Gear Guitars any way possible. And I, I just enjoyed making this video. So ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to get out of here. A huge shout out to Scott one more time. Thank you so much, dude. A huge shout out to Battle Gear Guitars for just making cool guitars. Huge shout out to all my patrons and a huge shout out to you. Yes, you watching home. Thank you so much for watching. If you're brand new to my channel and want to consider hitting that subscribe button, I'd really appreciate it. I'm out of here. Stay safe, stay healthy, stay metal. I'll see you guys next time. Later.